When I meet new people, I tend to run out of things to say. <laughs> Hi, I'm Johnny from The Art of Charm. And what I'd like to talk to you about today is a little held common belief that many introverts and even some extroverts tend to hold, which is when I meet new people, I tend to run out of things to say. Now I can understand why you might think that. You see, when meeting new people, there tends to be a lot of tension and pressure on the interaction, which puts us in a position to feel nervous, or even have some anxiety. This in turn pulls our focus inward in order to comfort ourselves. Now, if our attention is pulled inward, it makes it difficult for us to be in the moment and focus on the other person. This also has us overanalyzing everything that we say and makes conversation difficult. Let me ask you this, when you're speaking to your friends and family, do you have trouble coming up with things to say? Do you blank out? I bet you don't. I can also bet you tend to have wonderful conversations where your wit and personality and charm all shine through along with your great stories. So perhaps it's not that you run out of things to say, but perhaps it's because you're nervous around new people. And if that's the case, then we can go ahead and start working to get ourselves more comfortable to better conversations. So what I'd like to do is to give you three tips on how you can start to get more comfortable so you can start having better conversations today. Number one, try to have one conversation with one new person a day. This will give you an opportunity to meet new people and practice those skills. Number two, look to add one or two social events to your calendar a week. Now, I know what you're thinking. You're really busy, you don't have time for it, but no one said you had to be out all night long. Just an hour out of your day for this will help you out immensely. And number three, look for opportunities to speak to people who are in your everyday lives. Your barista, an Uber driver. Maybe even take yourself to the mall and hang out and chat with the retail folks. You know, these are people who are paid to be nice and answer your questions. They are a great opportunity for you to get to know these people and practice your skills. If you enjoyed these tips, continue watching our playlist to better conversations. See you guys later.